welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me for this video. This video today is on two gorgeous glamour transformations for my magazine, Dirty Glamour Magazine. If you don't know it or haven't heard about it, click the link down below and you can see a free copy. You can download a free copy or you can view the interactive version on my website uh, with swiping pages and titles and all that and that's yourjewel.com and if you love it you can purchase the print copy for seven dollars on MagCloud. So enough of that. Um, so today's transformation I'm taking a model and we're going to do full airbrush makeup. We're doing wigs and we're doing two totally completely different looks. Our first look is for Carmen San Diego who is a character, I believe from a video game, it's a, an opportunity to cosplay, and I thought it was super cool. This model had all the clothing pieces, so I didn't have to bring anything, but I did style the wig, and it came together really well, so I hope you enjoy that. Um, I have to apologize for my back in the camera, I did not realize, so, but as you can see here, I'm doing um, the airbrush makeup, and I'm using my amazing new airbrush gun by Dynair. It's the One Gun. If you want to learn more about that airbrush gun and airbrush makeup, I have a ton of videos. Um, and I'll put a link in here so you can see that. Um, we're going to go in and do some gorgeous natural but dark enough eyebrows for the photos. And we're doing like a brown wig, it, which looks like her hair color. So the look is super natural, but it's heightened for the camera, so it pops. Um, we've done airbrush foundation. We're now going in and doing the eyes and cheeks, and we're actually going to airbrush the lips as well. Um, and I find that it's just a lot quicker than using powders, and you could spend hours. This took me a few minutes to do. And then we're also going in and doing some gorgeous lashes. So I hope you like those. I have a link if you love those lashes you can use. They're great for the camera because they really pop. So I always recommend them. And uh, we're, we're also going in there and we're just going to cl clean up, tweak, and use mascara to seal her fake to a real. Um, I'm now going in and airbrushing her lips. And we picked uh, Crimson by Dynair for the lip. And I used just a little bit of lip liner to pop it up in certain corners. And that's my MAC Liner Cherry Red. Um, I will list with the products that I used. And a lot of them you can get on my Amazon store um, to make it really easy for you guys. So as you can see, the face is coming together really well. And uh, it's so fun to do this cosplay and comic characters and video game characters. So this was a, a really fun time. It was the first time I got to videotape it and do some video or actually do some pictures. Um, so as we go on, this is, she's in costume now and we're doing some wig styling. We also have her in lingerie by Hollywood Lifestyles Boutique and they were kind enough to supply the lingerie. It's a beautiful navy blue and you'll see that in the photo, uh, baby doll. So the wig was so much fun to create. I wanted a lot of volume and as you can see, it worked. So she's gonna put the hat on, which is the final piece to Carmen San Diego, and really pulls the character together. So I hope you enjoyed this video and stay here for the second look. It's coming, okay? Hang on guys, thanks so much for joining me. Like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> loved uh, the Carmen San Diego persona. I've always been a big fan. Um, and a few years ago, I tracked down, it took me forever to track down this hat. I got it from Poland. Um, and a matching, uh, matching coat that fit the persona. Um, and I wore it one year for, for a Comic Con, and then um, it just sat out of my closet. And I've, I'm so excited to be able to to take photos and to really realize the, the cosplay that I envisioned so, so many years ago. So I hope you enjoy it.
down.